the overall goal of this procedure is to evaluate mitochondrial respiration in the common fruit fly, Drosophila melanogaster, using high-resolution respirometry. This is achieved by first dissecting the Drosophila to collect the thorax. The thoraces containing the flight muscles are then carefully permeabilized mechanically with sharp forceps and incubated with saponin for further permeabilization. The thoraces are then transferred into the chambers of a respirometer and mitochondrial oxygen consumption is measured with a combination of different substrates, uncouplers, and inhibitors. Hi, I'm Chloé Simon from the laboratory of Nicolas Pichot in the Department of Chemistry and Biochemistry at the Université de Moncton. In this video, we'll show you how to measure in situ mitochondrial respiration in thor thoraxes from Drosophila using high resolution respirometry. We use this technique in our laboratory to measure oxygen consumption at several different steps of the electron transport system. The main advantage of this technique is that it requires very small amounts of tissue compared to the classic mitochondrial isolation procedure. It's also more physiologically relevant as all the interactions with the cellular components are conserved. We can therefore answer key questions about the fundamental mechanisms that control metabolism either during environmental challenges or under pathological conditions. For this experiment, we will use a high-resolution respirometer. This instrument measures real-time oxygen concentration in 2 milliliter glass chambers equipped with polarographic electrodes. The electrodes send a voltage signal to the computer, which is directly proportional to the concentration of oxygen. This measurement is seen on screen as a blue line.